this morning. We're leaving out just to Las Vegas because we're going to do a Las Vegas bourbon hunt. Here we go. It'll be fun. Okay guys, we're at, where are we at Tina? Town Square Market Mall. <laughs> In South Las Vegas. And uh, cause we're gonna go to Total Wine over there to start the hunt. But you know what? You can't go hunting on an empty stomach. So we're gonna go get some breakfast at this little place called the Broken Yoke. Brunch it up. Look at that. Look at the drinks. We're gonna get started right this morning here in Las Vegas. The broken yoke. Hey. start the day with an old-fashioned and that looks really good old-fashioned with bacon on it <laughs> at a breakfast place. yeah I'll It's got the orange, yeah, it's got the little orange kick on it. You got to take a sip of that, it's good. It is. Pretty good bourbon in there, it seems like. Don't know what they use, but... Basil Hayden. Uh-huh. So that's what you do with Basil Hayden. You put a lot of other stuff in it, and it'll taste better. Guys. We're gonna dig in and Tina needs to catch up. There you go. And we're going to enjoy this. So this has chorizo, it's got potatoes, it's got serrano peppers, it's got red onions, it's got I don't know, eggs, it's got everything that you can imagine. Oh, avocado. It's called the ranchero skillet. Restaurant, do potatoes like this. This is kind of how we do them at home, and just slice them up into these thin slices. And that's their home fries, guys. I love. We call them fried potatoes, but anyway, same thing. Home fries, yeah. So I love them like this. Okay. Just have to say. The food was really outstanding. I mean, the home fries, fresh cut home fried Dance potatoes. Slices. Perfect. Yep. Um, like every it. ingredient, the avocado, the, the peppers, the onions, the eggs, of course, everything was so fresh. How about yours? It was just delicious. Again, I'll rave about the home fries because the little thin 
sliced oh, potatoes mm -hmm. are the my favorite. They're yeah. the way I like it. This is how we make them at home, and it was just delicious. And the gravy sausage was excellent too, and I really enjoyed my Irish cream. Oh, coffee. the drinks were amazing. The service was exceptional. They they greeted you at the at the door, nice and friendly. They set you at the table, immediately was t explaining the menu. Yep. Um, we ordered our drinks. They come back. It, you know how some places you'll they'll order drinks and then you may not see somebody for a long time. Oh. They were back real quick. Y'all ready to take your order? We yes. took the order. Food came out like wow, very, very fast. It's so cool. Uh, and then they kept checking on you. Yep. The owner came by and talked to us, and Real nice. our manager, I guess. And yes. it was just uh, could be the owner. It could be owner, owner manager. manager. But yes, he they were checking just, on us. And, every single mm -hmm. person in there was wonderful. Yep. So now we're on the to total wine, and we'll see what they got in here and then after this we'll probably head to Lee's liquor a barrel we're, we're gonna get that but here's a private release hmm. jackpot where we getting one of these for all of you single barrel snobs <laughs> we got us a good pick here <laughs> eight years single barrel yep. barrel bourbon oh my gosh i'll be in like almost alphabetical order there's the baker seven which honestly we saw that a little bit cheaper Old trace 27 27 dollars 15 year 15 and 8. Hey, we're um, we're actually in Total Wine right now. And this place is just... You want to be overwhelmed on what whiskey to buy, just come here. <laughs> they have everything. And it's the prices are great. Yeah. Yeah, there's a 10-year Calumet for $81, which is actually cheap, but uh, but but still, oh my gosh. Oh yeah. 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 This is yeah. This is only two thousand, so that's not bad at all. <laughs> oh, and here's a Teeling whiskey, which is an Irish whiskey, 30 year single malt Irish whiskey, $2,000. But listen to this Louis the 13th Cognac, $11,499. Oh my God. And then the Heine, Heine, H I N E, Cognac Talent, $10,000. Do you want that for your birthday? I have to. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> hey, no doubt. <laughs> At least a car. Oh my God, this is crazy. Here's a Johnny Walker Blue Label Vegas edition. $280. That's actually pretty cool to have. But, yeah. All right, this is something that I, one of the viewers said if you can get this High West single or barrel select, this is a barrel select. So, a blend of straight bourbon whiskeys. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah. Decisions. Man. 
good stuff. I want to see. The, I want. I'm looking for a Frey uh, Ranch. I'm looking for a Frey Ranch single barrel. Is what I'm looking for. Oh, look at this, Tina. Here's a Honeysuckle Breeze oh, wow. Maker's Mark Private Barrel Selection. Oh, wow. And then this is a Maker's Mark Fireside Spice. That's the, where is that? Where is the Fireside Spice? That's the four Ford Boons. Hmm. The fire warmth and sweetness coat selection with hints of java, chocolate, and cinnamon. I wouldn't mind trying to find that. I gotta find that. I don't. I don't see the uh, Maker's Mark Fireside, which I would buy, but they. I don't see it up there. Looks like it's just up in the steel. Oh, Tina, look at here. Some smooth ambler. Uh -huh. All the way from West Virginia. Okay, from West by God. I'm surprised to see that here, actually. Mm -hmm. Two stars. I guess we're there. Got a Willet, which we have. And now we're heading down to some scotch. Okay. There's, there's so many choices here, but I think what we're going to do, because I just bottled this uh, barrel selection for a Breckenridge, and I'm going to get one, and then I'm going to pick one up for Dice and try to get it to him if if we have to, it'll be at Rocktoberfest. If not, we'll see if we can figure out how to get to him before that. Breckenridge Reserve Blend. Okay. That's it for here. Yeah. That's a couple of really nice picks. $200 down. Guys, I'm pretty happy about this. We got two bottles. We got the barrel, single barrel. Yep. And that's an amazing find. And then we found the two Breckenridge, and that's pretty cool because I'm gonna give one to Dice, who is gambling granny's husband. <laughs> the guru behind all the stuff. He's also gambling granny's good luck charm. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> when he goes to the restroom. <laughs> You're right, when he leaves. Plus, he's playing <laughs> We're going to go in to Lee's Liquor Store. See what they got here. There are several locations in Vegas. These Lee's Liquor Stores are huge, and this one is on Sunset Road. Glenn Fittich for three sixty-four. I've been wanting to try this one. The wee beastie. Look at all the Irish whiskeys. Japanese whiskeys. Wow. Hey, Suntory World Whiskey. Wow. It's like a, a blend of American and Canadian and Irish and Scotch. That is crazy. I bet Dan would love that. Allison would love that. Yeah. Tell them more do. Jameson Blackbird, triple distilled iron whiskey. Hmm. That looks good. $29.99. That's the best price I've ever seen 
for all three of these, I'm going to get that Emerald Giant because I'm, the girl, remember the girl said uh -huh. their, their rye was really good. So. Yep. And that'll complete the collection. Guys, it's pretty bad when you get a buggy. Going into the... We call them... Shop. We call them buggies in West Virginia and in Virginia. They're not shopping carts, it's a buggy. It's a buggy. <laughs> Tina, seriously, this is like the smoothest riding buggy I've ever pushed. <laughs> this thing is nice. Oh look, this must be what this is for. It's just a holder for your, for your whiskey. Nice, yes, for your... It's probably for your. I like that. That's for your uh, big gulp, actually, but that works too. Yeah. I like that picture. <laughs> Tina likes that. It fits perfectly. Golden Knights hockey. I know, and look at this. You can get this for you, Jack Daniels fans. $37 for this monster, monster of a gosh that's a lot <laughs> and here's gentleman jack big giant one for $44.99 look at that thing I'm, ooh, I don't want to buy this whole thing that thing shook when I pulled that ball out yeah. just to compare here's your normal size jack daniels compared to those Wow. Tina, you know you got some fine whiskey right here in your plastic bottle. I mean, it's you your can't get any nice plastic bottle of Fireball. You just for can't. For $13.99. Yeah. You just can't get any class here. That's fancy. They do not have that high west that no. I passed up on and I'm old. I'm going to have to go back and get that because that was nice. I'm a sucker for things like outlaw bourbon whiskey. Yeah, we're on the hunt. Just whatever, something rare. Look at like stuff like this, maybe. Let's look here. I've got Blanton's. Yes. And I'm glad I got it in, I got it in for $65 in Virginia. It's one of those drops. Yeah, so they Ooh. don't get it all. Tina, oh my they God, he's got a Elijah Craig. And then they're Craig. not allowed. You know, they, they have 18. to do the state. This is a new Elijah Craig. Yeah. Henry McKenna just got two bottles. Yeah. And nice. that's a good price because I just picked up that private barrel and I'm pretty sure I paid like 90 something for that. That's a good price. This Single barrel. Mm. Evan's door, the yeah. bootleg goes into that. Yeah. Wow. Bob Dylan. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he knows what he's doing, actually. I'll tell you. A lot of the, uh, I mean, he actually gets involved with the, the di distillation process. And here's what goes in there, this Heaven's Door bootleg. amazing like the way stores some things are really good deals and then other things are just a little bit more than other places there's no continuity in prices throughout throughout the country if you, as we've seen it's pretty crazy still want to try the Frey Ranch. I want to find a single barrel. The guy said if you could find a single barrel of the Frey Ranch that you should get that. So they've got a lot of selection here. 
but nothing like, like it's like really like hey you need to get this but we're going to pick up the redwood empire that we've been wanting to buy which was a good price yeah really good price on that 30 bucks all three of them. so i feel mad now because we paid ten dollars <laughs> more and then we paid five dollars more That's does have a free ranch the red ones are on the shelf single this bench. is the uh this is the the single barrel. He had barrel strength. This one here. I want it. We're gonna buy that. Nice. He's got and that for I have, ninety five. And then I have this one is new. That's a oh, rye. This is the rye. Yeah, straight yeah. rye. I'm sure that's good too, but I don't want to break my budget. We definitely <laughs> wanted the single barrel. So that's what I'm I was looking for. So I'm glad you. No, that, definitely. That's for, that one I keep locked up because it's higher. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Okay, so guys, this what is what I've been looking for. Frey Ranch single barrel. Mm -mm. All right, we've got one more stop. I've spent $335 in just two stops. Can y'all like send some <laughs> gas money for us to get home? <laughs> this bourbon hunt today is very expensive. We'll be using the whiskey as uh, gasoline probably. <laughs> <laughs> but that oh, but brings good. up, seriously, you want to help support me on these <laughs> bourbon hunts and things like that, then uh, sign up at Patreon and and then also you can sign up as a YouTube member, but that helps. So all the times we've been to Vegas, I've been wanting to eat at Pink Box, but I've never had the chance. But we're going to take the chance right now and go have a Pink Box donut. Oh, yeah. You can get you a coffee, too. I know. I was high in their drinks. That's what I'm going to do. I like the move. It's free. I like their little donut handles. <laughs> oh my gosh, they got the cool ones. First time in a pink box. First time? Oh yeah. my gosh, you came to the right place. I'm sure uh, I can tell by the look. I hope so. I hope so. Dang. You came so. to the second half of this place on earth. And where's the first? Uh, this land. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this land. You have this place on the second half. Of this place. That is true. You kidding? All right, we'll just get six. We're just going to get six. The Golden Nuggets one. Uh, Golden Nights. Well, we got Donut Croissants. Golden Nights. Did I say Nuggets? No? I said Nuggets. Golden Nights. Golden Nights. Try, try my Donut Croissants. Donut Croissants. Here. Here you go, Sunshine. Try that. That's good. That's good. I'm very good. Let's try. Do you like uh, uh, savory, sweet, uh, cheesecake, cherries, uh, apple pie? I have birthdays. I have uh, caramel cheesecake, coffee, lemon. He got it all. Uh, I have a brown, brown sugar. Brown sugar, sugar. Sugar, sugar. Mmm. Sugar, sugar. You guys, what else am I love? Chocolate old fashioned. One chocolate old fashioned at your service, young man. Well, here. Oh my gosh. And a Coco Loco. One Coco Loco for you. Well, here. <laughs> and a hockey puck. Is that six? I think that's six. I think you're at three and four. Coco Loco and a hockey puck. Oh, did you get hers? Two more. The brown sugar sugar, you got she that? Did. Okay. Yeah. That's only four? That's it. Gosh. All right, let's see. Do you want one of those hockey pucks too? Uh-uh. 
You want to eat that? Try something crazy that you've never had. I have peanut butter and jelly. I have strawberries and cream. Oh. I have mango. Wow. I have Oreo cookies. Oh. Let's do the PB and J. PB, that does. And it. your last one, my darling. You eat, you eat uh, co cocoa pebbles all the time. Tootie fruity. Wow, fruity tootie coming right up. <laughs> You're all set, my darlings. Let's and twist. Oh, that was a good one. We don't have to eat all of them at one time. But we might try. Tina wants to show off her cup. I love my little beatbox cup. Isn't it cute, y'all? Oh, how adorable. Oh, it's gonna make the drink even better. <laughs> Man, I just got chocolate milk. Hold on just a second. All right, so Tina's gonna have her sugar. Uh, brown sugar, sugar. And I'm gonna have this before it melts. This is the Las Vegas Nights hockey puck <laughs> and it's like chocolate on chocolate in front of liquor world which is right off industrial drive and desert inn and uh we couldn't go in here yesterday because we had to cut our bourbon hunting short because we had to go meet our good friends paula and dale mckenzie and we hang out and had dinner with them and uh so but we're going to go in now to this liquor world right here they got a lot of music going on and all kind of noise this is a loud area town so we're gonna go in and see what they got looking for the bourbon oh it's over here oh look at here oh my gosh Tina they got a big cabinet full of look at this Talisker single malt scotch whiskey those look great And this is the Crown Royal we picked up in New Mexico, <clears throat> in New Mexico from my buddy Stephen, and it's two seventy nine right here. It is a collector's bottle. We got it for one fifty nine. I mean, that's pretty nice. Yeah, that's good. My son likes down more. <laughs> oh my God! Look, this whistle pig. Uh, is 559, the 18 year. E.H. Taylor. Wow. Bottled and bond, E.H. Taylor, 129. This is, what's, that's small batch. This is. I think they got the bottles mixed up. One's a hundred proof, and, but they're both a hundred proof. One's a small batch, one's warehouse C. Okay, so well, warehouse C is 300, or maybe 30,000. I don't know, they don't have any dots. Yeah. And the other one's 399. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's Weller, full proof, 349. Kentucky Owl. Here's a Van Winkle for, I think that's $12,999. That's right here. But there's no decimals in there, so I'm pretty sure that's $12,999.
Wilderness Trail bourbon. I've been looking for that. Yeah, we've seen it in a couple spots. Yeah. Ooh, look at this. Stranahan's Blue Peak. That's a single malt. Colorado single malt. Oh, yeah. Rich and mellow. Solero finish. I've not uh, seen Solero that. finish. That's different. Yeah, this place has a lot of good stuff. Buffalo trades for thirty seven ninety nine. And this is another strain of hands, and that's a sherry cask. $94.99. Several smoke wagons. We picked up a Frey Ranch, and I cannot wait to try that. There's a winter Jack Cider. This is the Heaven's Door single barrel we have, Tina. But that well, the other one I don't know. That was a it was a uh, store pick. Yeah. Get right. Did you see Tina the uh, oh that bad. oh the Knob Creek Cast Street Street right. Right. Hmm. Hmm. There's Woodenville. They also, Lee's also had that Sagamore, the double oak, which I really want to get. Oh, yeah. See, this, here's chicken cock, but we found that a lot cheaper in Tennessee. Yeah. Old Bardstown. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. We might get that when we visit. We're going to visit Bardstown, Kentucky in July, so yeah. can't wait for that. All right, they, they had a really good selection of stuff in there. and uh, But a lot of things we we already have and uh, picked up. So, And then there's a lot of stuff we don't have. It's some, they have some amazing scotches in there and a lot of different uh, Irish whiskey. So it's pretty cool. So you might want to check out Liquor World sometimes. It's a pretty nice place. Guys, this is our second day. <laughs> second day in Vegas, and we have really Vegas. good ideas with us. <laughs> Vegas best ideas, and one Fair, of their fairly average ideas. <laughs> <laughs> and one of their fairly average ideas was come to what is it? Chili Chili Dillies. Chili Dillies. Chili Dillies with a Z. <laughs> the end. Uh, okay. Well, yeah. whatever it is, <laughs> it's really, really good. I've eaten here several times. Okay, Tamara and Gord are taking us to the greatest barbecue place ever, right? It's our favorite. Okay. So. <laughs> Hopefully, we don't hype it up too much. Let's see if it lives up to the. Oh yeah. This is the best barbecue. <laughs> in this part of town <laughs> all right all right <laughs> and i like the door already well see whenever there's like happy looking pigs then that means it's good oh cool That's nice. And we can go in this way. Hello, how are you? No, no we're gonna be five. Right. I think they came in. No, they must have went in already. They must have already come in. Oh, they got They've already got a table, thank you. <laughs> 